What's up, brothers and sisters? This is another episode of Spiritual Ventilation. I've been uh, I've been uh, out of commission for a little minute, but uh, gaslighting is real, gang stalking is real. I just want to let y'all know. Keep your head up and keep your eyes on the prayers because everybody's watching everybody. Everybody's watching everybody. Everybody is curious. Especially if you if you got that glow. So, you know, you don't, it ain't materialistic things that make you glow. It's in you. It's in you. It can't be on you. It is, it's in you. But uh, a young lady, I'm at the real shop, and uh, I don't even need port. But God sent me on a spiritual journey today and wanted me to get some rib tips. And I don't even like barbecue sauce, but I've been fasting so much that my current weight is 224 pounds with clothes on. So my prayers and those who are watching, me, I seeing the transformation in me. Excuse me, I'm sitting here at the courthouse and I'm watching things, so you know, I just seen some things, so I, I had to glance over and see what's going on. But those who who are seeing my transformation and me going through my uh what's that word? Uh stasis. Going through my stasis, I would I think that's the word stasis. Me going through my transformation, people are curious. Yeah, I'm 224. And I still got my buck. But one thing I know is weights I like drugs. Because them same weights you hitting when you get older, your body's gonna say, hey, where are some weights that you always been hitting at? So it's all all, all that mass that you are forming is gonna make it hard for you for you to maintain it when you get older. Because what old person won't sit there and just keep lifting weights? So I'm more on getting leaner. So I fast, I fast a lot. I don't eat, I don't eat a meal probably until I get hungry. And that's probably every four days. But other than that, I'm snacking, I'm eating on, on fruits and vegetables. And, and, but every four or five days, your body needs needs a good meal. I'm not gonna lie. So my, my path took me today it took me to um, to the rib shack, and uh, man, they got some excellent rib tips, man. I just wish they had turkey tips or something, man. I don't know, do they make turkey tips? Cause I don't know. I think I would like turkey tips better than rib tips with no barbecue sauce. I don't eat no barbecue sauce when if I do have to eat ribs. But let me get back on track, cause I got a lot of stuff up here that I've been storing and a lot of downloads. Um, the lady just kept pressing up on me like, what is it? I told her I was on a dirty dad. She said, what's a dirty dad? I get down and dirty about my dad. <laughs> she started laughing. She said, I used to be on a dirty dad. And uh, we just laughed it off. So I wrote a prescription. I said, well, get on your dirty dad twice a day. And uh, uh, what I say, and, and eat watermelon and fruits and vegetables while you doing it. And she started laughing. And I told, I said, uh, you keep talking to me. I said, your girlfriend in the car gonna get mad. So this is the thing. It's all about what you indulging in. And I told her that she's indulging in the physical, just like we indulge in the, in, in, in the spiritual. So her girlfriend was letting her suck the game up and she wanted my number so I can be her life coach. But she just, she was just so curious of why I got this glow and, and why I look like I look. So evidently she's been seeing me probably my whole life because I've been <clears throat> I've been in the same area for a long time. So um, I just explained to her that uh, I get on a treadmill and I walk fast and I don't lift no weights. I just do all cardio and uh, she was like, well, can I get your number so you can be my life coach? I said, well, look, like I said, get on your dirty dad. 
and just eat fruit. So she 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 damn near made me get made me give me give her my number. And uh it's temptation behind it because I heard her talking to church members why she was talking to me. You know what I'm saying? And then not only that, she has a girlfriend in the car. So ain't this a, a backwards world? We are in a multi universe. Uh everything is backwards. Everything is backwards. And um uh, I feel like everybody's three dimensional and I feel like I'm in 12D. <laughs> I'm in a 12D. So I don't know, man. I don't know what to say, man. I've been I'm really forming my body. I'm really forming my body, man. And uh I'm really forming it. And I, I I don't know what to say, man. I have so much to say. I just feel like I need to spiritual ventilate today. Uh I'm drinking on a lot of lemon water. I'm uh I'm eating, I'm bypassing the process of, of smoothies. I'm just eating ginger root raw. Like I'm just biting in it with the skin on it. I'm I'm biting, I'm eating on um uh, raw uh, uh uh garlic probably every three or four or five days. I'm trying to wean myself off blood pressure medicine. My blood pressure now is 131 over 92. Uh, I feel great. I feel great. So, uh, do a lot of sunbathing. Um, and I don't know, stay sucker free. That's all I can say. Stay sucker free. Stay away from these haters, man. RP to my Aunt Brenda. And uh, a lot of people won't be the borough of light. Everybody's in competition and want to be the one that knows the most. Even, even the younger folks want to uh, 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 jump over the older folks and, and and say say things like, "Yeah, we're back in the day. <laughs> back in the day, we used to eat dogs." Man. Ah, look at that. I'm just sitting there thinking about what makes a good friend a good friend. So. I, got, I came up with five things. Number one, good friends tell you the truth about yourself. Number two, good friends rather ask for money. Real friends have a complex about putting their burdens on you. Number three, no matter how long y'all been friends, good friends, real friends, don't get comfortable and get disrespectful. Rule number four, real friends add value, they make your life better. Rule number five, real friends stay the same and treat you the same regardless who they're around. If you got a friend that fit these all five, you probably got a real friend. Go so treat them right. Real friends rap.